What's up guys, Artrix here and welcome back to another video. In today's video you're going to see a pre-review of Lorenzo Insigne's screen card. As you can see I bought him for 850k and he's 5 foot 4, high medium rock rates, right footed, faster weak foot and faster skills. And if we look at his stats, he has 91 pace, 93 traveling, 87 shot and 87 passing, which looks amazing. But now let's look at this in-game stats. So he has 96 acceleration and 86 sprint speed. And in the shooting category he has 93 attack positioning with 84 finishing, 87 shot power and 93 long shots, which look amazing. And in the dribbling stats, he looks perfect with 96 agility, 95 balance, 85 reactions, 95 ball control, 91 traveling and 84 composure. But now let's look at some clips I got with him and see if he's worth about 900k. Alright, first up I wanna talk about his cam style. I decided to use Hawk on him, but you also could take Hunter because it only boosts his pace and shooting and Hawk boosts his pace shooting and also his physical. But for me, Hawk was good enough because his pace and also his shooting stats are so good, they don't need the boost Hunter gives. Okay, let's begin with the best thing about this card. His pace combined with his dribble. With the chemistry style he has 99 acceleration, 91 sprint speed, with his 96 agility, 95 balance and also his 95 ball control. Therefore defenders aren't able to get the ball of him easily. It was very easy to triple past defenders or play 1-2s with Messi or Screen Bernard, which are played around him, because he is lightning fast and is so agile. Next up, I wanna talk about his passing. With 89 draw passing and 91 vision, he was able to play passes all over the pitch. I uh, thought that his long passes were way better than 79, which is his stat, and also his curve with 89 doesn't represent what he does in game. For me, I'd say it's a 99. Next up, shooting. For me, his shooting was sometimes perfect and sometimes not the best. I can't say why, but I think it's very inconsistent. He was able to finish every shot in some games and in other games he wasn't able to do anything. He hit the post like three times in the same match and in the next game he banked all of them. Because of that, I can't say that the shooting is perfect, but it's still very good. Last but not least, physically. Because he's only 5 foot 4 and has only 59 strength, I thought that he will be very weak. But in game, he didn't even feel that weak. And he also has 99 stamina, which is just amazing. He's able to play for 90 or 120 minutes, it doesn't matter. And I used him as a striker, which means he doesn't lose fitness at all. So he was just lightning fast the whole game. Now to the conclusion. Is he worth about 1 million coins? Let's find out. I'd say yes. He was such a good player and because he's so agile and so fast, he's just the perfect striker in this FIFA. I used him next to Messi and I have to say he was nearly as good as Messi was. Because of that, I have to give him a 9.5 out of 10. But while you was, I have to say it's only a 9 out of 10 because I think 1 million coins is a little bit too much for him. Alright, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. Also, every sub is highly appreciated. And if you guys have any more questions, review wishes or improvements for my reviews, please let me know in the comments. And I also will leave a link to my Twitter and to my mate's YouTube channel where you can find more player reviews down below. But for now guys, I'm out. Peace! There's a distance between us It's getting hard to reach out